Hi, this is T.H. Colhane for Solar Cities. We're in Kathy Ned Puffer's basement with Chris Lindstrom, uh, another basement biodigester uh, tinkerer. And we're looking at a tank where we removed the feeding pipe because of a clog, because it was filled with horse manure. The horse manure clogged up the pipe, and the horse manure has also created a scum layer that keeps the gas from coming out. However, this is producing methane. It's now open. It's just methane in here where I'm sticking my hand. As you can see, if I try to light it, nothing happens up here, even though it's open. But to prove that there's methane, you look down here, there's the methane igniting. There's no air in the tank, and so it cannot be explosive, and it's filled with water. But just so you can see that the methane is there, and it is burning, it is, however, safe. Um, a lot of people are worried about, well, if I keep a basement biodigester, what happens if there's a leak? Well, this is the biggest leak you can possibly come up with right here. It's a huge two-inch hole and just methane filling an 8-inch airspace. Normally, there's no airspace at all or no methane space because we keep these tanks filled with water all the time and the gas is forced out into the collection bag. But should you have a situation where you have gas buildup inside and it pushes the uh, the, fer the fertilizer up into these buckets and so there is a quantity of gas like in this one as you can see it is safe it will burn but it burns right here locally and it does not burn up here in the air it disperses too quickly there's even around the perimeter here there is no burning just until I get right there and even if I stick the flame all the way inside it cannot burn inside again, no oxygen. Now there's one exception to this rule. If you're blowing air in and you don't let it positively the pressure come out, obviously there'd be air in there. What that might do is cause a, a, a quick flash of expansion, but it'll come out this hole. Maybe it would, uh, if you had nothing else, it would burst these uniseals and you get splattered with, with, uh, with water, with dirty water. But it's not a hazardous situation. And you could see in that one I let it build up for a while and it came up a little higher, right? But that's the, the basic safety of these, of, these, uh, of these digesters. Poof, just like that. Okay, so I want to allay people's fears, and um, you can try this at home.